Um, I want to show you how to set this up so when you're at home, you know, you can do it yourself. I usually use uh, three paper towels. These are the kind I don't like because you have to fold them. But... So I have to do this and try to hold this phone. Line in the bottom. Gonna use her um, stuff that she's already used to. This is her cage. Let's see, sketch. Okay. So the first thing I put in, I'm gonna give you this bowl. It's just a little bowl. Actually, it's a bowl holder. And you're gonna put the two bowls in there. Let's see. Then. She's actually right here. See her? So, maybe she's gonna let me move this over. This branch, um, it's just bamboo. You can get that at a nursery or Lowe's, Home Depot, and cut it to size. On these tubs, just make sure it fits in that little groove right there. See? You don't want it sticking up past this because their lid will you know, go all the way shut. Um, this is just a little, you can turn this cup this way or this way, but I like it this way. She doesn't really hide in it. And this is that um, New Zealand sphagnum moss. Just fill it up. Keep that in there. It kind of keeps it in one spot. And then this is a foam um, pipe insulation cover. You can get that at Home Depot. Like a six foot one. See? And I just cut it to size. It fits right in there. And you just kind of rest it on that stick. If you don't have the stick in there, it'll just keep falling. And I like to put the bowl with the food under that stick because they like to sit on here and lean down and eat. This is what I use for water bowls. Uh, it's a little ramekin. You can get it on Amazon. And I mean, for now, you can um, just put the water in one side and the food in the other since she's so little. This bowl right here, though, is perfect for bugs. Dubia. You put the dubia in this bowl, like, you know, five or six little tiny ones. Put them in the bowl under this foam perch or next to the stick, and they learn that that's where the bugs are, and they'll run every time you put that bowl in there. So then you just, um, put the bugs in here that are already coated with the calcium, then she will sit on this little perch and lean down and eat the bugs out of the bowl. Then you won't have bugs running around in your tub. Um, and then this is some more of that moss. But this is really all you need. Then you clean out her cage once a week, like a thorough cleaning. You're just going to take this to the sink and use a strainer and just squeeze it out real good until it looks pretty clean. But that stuff lasts a long time. See? She already knows her new little cage.